Welcome to Cebu Expat by Matt Wilkie, discussing expat life in the Philippines. What is a ballot buying box? A ballot buying box is basically a box of gifts that Filipinos send home from abroad, um, but it's also what foreigners basically send all their stuff to the Philippines in. Um, it's normally done with quite an expansive network. It's not normally one courier. What happens is the things seem to move like ants, you know, like somebody moves it to one destination, it moves. It may not be um, the fastest way to move things, but it will eventually get there. I know from the UK to the Philippines, it normally takes me two months to get a box there. Um, but I'm only paying about 24 pounds uh, for quite a big box. The the thing is, it just sits there. You know, if you imagine you have a ship um, that's going from, say, Manila to Cebu. If you pay a premium, you'll get it on that day. But if you want to go for the lowest fare, what you do is you just leave it at the dockside until they have vacancies on the ship where basically they've got space and nobody's actually wanting anything moved as such. It goes on the ship then. Um, so that's why it takes time. Positive side of this, it's an easy way to move good stuff into the Philippines. Um, when I say good stuff, I'm talking about tea, <laughs> tea, oxo cubes and um, all those treats because of biscuits and things like that that you may not find in the Philippines. Um, peri peri sauce and all this stuff, that's what normally in mine, as well as things like the Asda runs. Asda runs. Well, Asda, I think it's part of Walmart. What I do is I get all the soap products. I get all the ones that are on sale, you know, like a um, pound each or buy two, get one free, all that sort of stuff. And they're gifts we give away. Um, they're imperial leather, uh, oil of ule, all that sort of stuff. Because the quality is very different. Uh, to what people get in the Philippines um, because of whatever reasons the different recipes or whatever maybe it's a cheaper recipe or maybe that the market's different whatever reason there's a huge difference on quality that's why my mother-in-law likes the oil of ule from Europe better than the stuff that you can get in the Philippines um, also I'd question the regulations in the Philippines on how much of this stuff is actually originals um because obviously there's less stringent um coding practices now from a expat point of view i recommend sending one for christmas for the family um people look forward to this all year round um i'll be honest with you sitting doing this video i'm realizing i need to get one done <laughs> um this is like the biggest thing for some people all year, you know, because they can get school books or uh, stuff, stuff that's not available. I mean, that's the big thing. Stuff is not available. Um, but be aware, some people don't like some stuff like pasta. Um, not, all, not everybody likes pasta, um, which is why we had somebody coming around selling us their pasta that they got in the ballet buying because they don't need it. So it's worth if you're doing food products to find out what actually people like. But it is good to send these boxes. Um, like I said, take a few months to get there, but people really appreciate it. And it's the best Christmas gift you can give people um, because they don't know what they're getting. And it's been so random, but also it's not expensive because where you are in your country, um, you can find some fantastic deals on stuff, um, which would be horrendously expensive in the Philippines. I say horrendous a bit over the top, but um, you would pro <laughs> some of the products would be like three, four times the price. Um, that's why it's worth doing. Also, some of the stuff just isn't available. You know, if you sent some uh, cider, for example, from the UK or uh, speckled hen or whatever, uh, it's stuff that's very hard to find. Um, so it's well worth doing. And people, like I said, people love it. But that's what ballot buying box is. Um, and you'll find some of them on my video, uh, on my um, 
blog. Uh, Tropical Pen Pals is now being basically wiped out. Uh, it's gone all the SIBO expat. Uh, I'm going to start writing on that again soon. Um, but it's basically just cardboard box wrapped up with <laughs> miles and miles of uh, brown tape. And that's your ballot buying box. But it's the gift that keeps giving, you know, because every year you do one, but every year people love it. Well worth doing.